so throughout um, your kind of outreach to EpiServer, we were thinking that if the ongoing performance of ReachDesk and the customer care that we get from ReachDesk is as good as the outreach and the sales process, then we can't really go wrong. I think um, it was, I'll always sort of remember how we learned about reach desk it was in the heat wave last year and you sent a desk fan to um to danny which was extremely appreciated and actually kind of solved a lot of our internal office air conditioning conflicts that i'm sure every office has um we just gave gave the desk fan to one of our colleagues he likes the, the air con at 18 degrees um but i just thought that was so sort of timely and relevant and it just caught our attention um and then just the ongoing conversations I just always felt um like it was extremely personalized and yeah like I said it just made us think actually if you guys take this much care to get our attention and kind of nurture us through the buying process then we kind of assumed that the ongoing support and performance of reach desk would, would match that. Reach desk ability to sort of add something more exciting and add something a bit different to the sort of B2B marketing and selling process. A lot of the teams um, started thinking about using direct mail um, as in their sort of outbound efforts, um, the new business team, customer marketing team, um, we really wanted to kind of add something a bit different um, to our outbound efforts. Um, and I think it's uh, is definitely having reached us has definitely helped sort of add a different element to our BDRs outbound messaging, our account managers outbound messaging. giving time back to the marketing department to actually come up with cool ideas, things that they think will actually be really sort of attention grabbing and eye catching to cold prospects, to existing customers. It kind of gives us a lot more freedom to actually run with those ideas um, rather than thinking oh, in an ideal world, wouldn't it be great if we could if we could do this, but actually the reality is that you have to, uh, there's loads of different sort of manual elements you have to take into consideration, but actually with Reach Desk, you have a lot more freedom to, um, yeah, to actually put those ideas into, into practice. And then on top of that, actually have um, visibility into, into what's working and what's not.